the Predator Bolt Gun, also referred to as Spear Gun or Spear Tip Launcher, is a Yaucha projectile weapon that launches razor-sharp metal spikes towards a target. The weapon is ideal for sniping and operates almost silently, allowing the user to remain stealthy while attacking. They come in a manner of designs from handheld versions to ones located on the Predator's wrist gauntlet. The version wielded by the Feral Predator from Prey was named the Bolt Gun and fired homing projectiles which sought out their targets by way of the Biomask Laser. The system used a standard triple laser sight, but each dot could separate to target up to three individual body parts. Up to three rounds could be held in the chamber and were elevated into the firing position by what looked like either an anti-gravity or magnetic field, and then were shot out at high velocity. The ammunition had an onboard guidance system that would lead them to each laser. After firing, the bolts could then be retrieved by the Predator for reuse. It features a handle grip with a trigger and had small white lights on the side which indicated when it was ready to fire. When not in use, the weapon could be stored on a dedicated mount located on the Predator's back. While the version seen in Prey will likely go down as the best known example of the weapon, the first official time the weapon was seen was in Predator 2 when the City Hunter attacked the Jamaicans inside the penthouse. This version fired a U-shaped spear tip with two forward-facing serrated prongs. These are made of an unknown metal that doesn't correspond to anything on the periodic table and are almost weightless but cut like steel. This type is fired from a slot located on the bottom of the wrist gauntlet and seemed to be unguided. In Predator 1, when Blaine is first hit, if the movie is paused at the right moment, some sort of projectile can be seen just before it makes impact. While we don't know what it is fired from, the original creature design was meant to feature a spear gun weapon, which was then replaced by the plasma caster in the final design. This would have been the first time the weapon was used, but since it is never confirmed in the final version of the film exactly what it's supposed to be, it cannot be said for certain. It's also possible this could have been one of the Jungle Hunter's wrist blades being shot out like we see other Predators do in later films. In the video games Aliens vs Predator and Aliens vs Predator 2, a two-handed version of the spear gun is used. This type is so powerful it can decapitate a human if shot in the head or impale them to walls if shot in the body. It also features a scope like a sniper rifle. In the AVP Extinction, the spear gun used by the Stalker unit type was an extremely long range weapon that was silent and would cause bleeding when upgraded to fire bleeder spears. The bleeder spear gun fires a large number of hideously barbed harpoons. And in Predator Concrete Jungle, the Scarface Predator used a handheld version with telescoping action allowing it to be reduced in size when not in use to make it easier to carry. So that was the bolt gun and spear gun weapons. The version we saw in Prey was one of my favourite additions from that film, and was done in an interesting way. I thought it was really creative how they designed it and how it worked, and I feel it fits really well into the Predator universe. Remember to leave a like on the video for all the effort I've put into making it, and subscribe if you aren't already. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.